Okay. It's been a while since I've vlogged a day in the life. Hey y'all, it's Butters. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having an absolutely fantastic day full of positivity and happiness as always. <laughs> and for today's video, it has been two years since I have vlogged the last day in the life of a gaming YouTuber. So today I'm taking you along for the ride. I got a couple of chores I gotta do today. And I also just have the urge to go outside. And as a gamer, if I wanna go outside, I'm going outside. <laughs> I went ahead and made coffee and breakfast while I ate my breakfast, which was leftovers. They were lunch wrap things. I'll put them right here on the screen if you wanna see, cause I posted them to my Instagram yesterday. But for the most part, I uh, spent this morning laying in bed, watching some YouTube and drinking my coffee. And then I decided to get up. This is what I looked like before I got up. Look at me, looking all slouchy and looking like I slept because I did. And here's the after. Here's today's outfit for those who are curious. I don't normally wear this dark of colors, but I don't know, today I'm kind of feeling it. It is officially 2023 and I know this isn't exciting for a lot of people, but I'm really excited about it. I always look forward to getting a new planner. So this is my planner from 2022. That was the year it was, and this is my planner this year. I love it. I especially like this hollow sticker. Oh, you okay, Kat? Planners help keep me organized. I will be using this today. What do I have to do today? Are you okay, Kat? Did you hear that? <laughs> She's sprinting down the hallway, it's fine. But for today's task, what I gotta take care of, I have some Amazon returns that I gotta return. I might go out and buy some PC parts for my sister's build. I do plan on building a PC for her and making a video on it, so I think today's the day I wanna do that. I want to stop by a certain consignment store because they have a rug there that I really want for my office. I like the one in here, but the other one speaks to me a little bit, and if they still have it, I kinda wanna see if, it, if I can get it. If it's not there, it's fine. Wasn't meant to be, but if it is, I want it. Oh, I'm selling my Facebook PC. Do you guys remember when I built that PC for a YouTube video, I bought a PC off the Facebook marketplace and then did a good old case swap and made it really pretty. Yeah, I, I'm selling it. I'm kind of excited, kind of sad, but I know it's going to a good home, so I'm gonna make sure it's good to sell. I want to grind some Modern Warfare 2. I am a gaming YouTuber. I should probably do that. <laughs> and depending on how I'm feeling, I'm either going to stream or I am going to record my Platinum Snipers video. Either way, I'm excited to bring y'all along for the ride, and uh, before we go, I guess I'll show y'all my office as well. Here's my office. It's a little messy, but it could be worse. Yeah, I don't have my gaming PC on at the moment, which is this one because I'm not gaming right now, but I do have my secondary PC on because I was doing business emails and all of that stuff, but I'm going to step out of the house today. I'm going outside. Since I'm going outside, what jacket do I wear? I'm kind of feeling this one, but this one looks so good with the blue on my shirt. I'm not gonna overthink it. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with this jacket today. Hi, how are you doing today? Do you want the sushi? Do you want the sushi? Get it. Hi, you're so fluffy. How are you? Do you want the ice cream? Here you go. I hope you like it. <laughs> Did you get it? Thank you so much. Was there something on the lens? <laughs> I also need my glasses because I can't see very well. I need them to drive. Cat, can you not? <laughs> Why are you doing? You're so cute, look at your little pink nose. Anyways, let's go ahead and head out. <laughs> My day's starting out with no gas. <laughs> That's a good way to start. It's a cloudy day. Nice day, actually. Not too cold either. Here I go, filling up some gas. While I was filling up gas, a horn started honking quite a bit. That was fun. And here we are at Goodwill. I decided to make a quick pit stop because I was looking for some picture frames, but here's some stuff that I found interesting. Purse, did not want it. Another purse, did not want it, kind of fun. Star dress, kind of fun, didn't want it. Little tiny baby shoes, look how small they are, they're so good. I always keep my eye out for camo. I always find camo when I go thrifting. It just, I gravitate towards it. These pants terrified me a little bit. These pants did not terrify me. And here I am looking at denim because I can't help myself. I love denim. And this, this pair was interesting apparently, cool. And here we are at the picture frames and I found one that I like. And this one was cute too. Hi, you're a little bit behind my steering wheel, hope you don't mind, but Goodwill trip was fun. I went in there specifically for picture frames for my Shorty Awards letter and my YouTube letter. I didn't find a frame for my YouTube letter, but I did find one for my Shorty Awards one. Uh, this isn't real wood, unfortunately, but it's really hard to find a frame of this size, so I'm just going to take it. I also found this denim shirt because I'm a sucker for denim, I love denim, but look, it's embroidered. It has sunflowers on it and it has flowers on the collar. Can you see that? I had to have it. I can layer it under sweatshirts. Oh, and I also bought this hat 
I don't know much about it, but I like the color. I like everything on the sides. I don't know, it's a weird one, but I like it. Oh, I also bought some pants, by the way, but they're too far down there. I can't show you right now. Maybe later. Let me sanitize my hands. This stuff always makes me cough. Don't cough, don't cough, don't cough. <coughs> God. But now I've got a couple more errands to run. I actually have to run to my bank. Totally forgot about that. Um, yes, I'm just gonna get it all moving. Off we go to our next pit stop. This is CC Liquidations. It has amazing, amazing furniture and art. I saw this one and I was intrigued by it, but I decided no. I did a wave high there. I saw this blanket, look how fluffy. And here I am walking towards the rugs. I'm taking a look. This one caught my eye, but unfortunately the one that I wanted is not there anymore. Next pit stop is this little pho place. I absolutely love pho and ramen. So here I am spicing up my pho, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. There's a little jalapeno in here as well that looks like a steering wheel. So I decided to try and drive with it. I'm sure I'm drifting in my mind. <laughs> and up next, we're going to Micro Center to pick out some parts. I highly, highly recommend if you live close to a Micro Center to check it out. Um, the employees will definitely help you with getting a custom build. A lot of people ask me, um, I don't know what parts to get. Well, these people do. There's also used parts, by the way, which I think is fascinating. I've definitely done it before. They have to test the parts before they sell them. But here are all the parts that I picked up for my sister's build. Actually, I think I returned this graphics card. It's fine. But also, I had to stop by the G Fuel fridge, pick myself up a G Fuel cane. And last but not least, I did stop by the grocery store because my sister and her husband were sick and were craving some certain foods. So, of course, I got it for them. And here's a lovely sunset to end off the errands. I just brought in all of Haley's parts for her PC build. I bought this today and the processor. Motherboard I already had. It's a used one. Still works fine. And the case I bought a little bit ago. So I'm excited for this build. Don't know when I'm building it yet. So long story short, it's the next day. I got home at about, well, I was out from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. Hello, cat. Good morning. I was out from about 10, 11 a.m. to I got back at 6 or 7 p.m. And my camera died, so I thought, I'm gonna charge it and take a little nap. Well, that nap lasted a lot longer than I thought. So <laughs> I did play a couple games of COD last night, but definitely not as much gaming as I would have liked to. Um, but here in a bit, I'm going to go to the boat and see my dad. We're gonna get some lunch and we're gonna talk about some uh, renovating that we want to do to the boat. So. I will take you guys there. But first, I want coffee. Y'all haven't seen the living room in a while. You wanna see? Hold on. Here's my living room, a little messy. I have my purse and my boots on the floor, but I love this couch so much. This couch, I get. I usually don't splurge on anything, but I decided to splurge on this couch, and my gosh, it is my favorite piece of furniture that I own. Oh, she shocked herself, oh no. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I'm going to sit here and drink my morning coffee. My skin is not happy today. What happened yesterday? <laughs> I'm going to sit here and drink my coffee, uh, go on some social media, and then I'm going to go see my dad. Ah, good old social media. I usually start my day scrolling social media and just catching up with the world. I am on social media as a job, so I figured it's important. Also, here's my cat again. Hello. Guess who's wearing a Canadian tux today? Are you okay? All right, and she ascends. Well, get up there. <laughs> Nicely done. Anyways, guess who's wearing a Canadian tux today? Me. I will always match my denim if I can. I love denim. Thank you so much. Can I pet you? No? I understand. I'm sorry. <laughs> Here you go. Hey. Hey. How are you? Thank you. Thank you so much. I didn't even press record. Awesome. Um, yeah, I posted to my Instagram story. Uh, my cat's tail is up there and I find it funny, but I figured I'd put it in the vlog because social media is kind of my job, so feel free to follow me if you want to. You don't have to though. Hello cat. <laughs> Finally made it to the lake. This is my happy place. And for those who don't know, I do own a boat. <laughs> Let me show you. Here she is. She is a 1995 Carver 390 CPMY or cockpit motor yacht. She's like a cabin on the water with two bedrooms. She's a fixer upper, but once she's all dolled up, I definitely plan on making a video all about my boat. I love walking down the dock and taking in the scenery. My boat neighbors are nice, but this view, just too nice. My happy place. Here's the lake, just in case you didn't know. Be careful stepping in, there's no staff there. Oh, you're absolutely right. <laughs> Good call. Hey, Dad. I'm at the boat. 
It's a little torn down right now, can you tell? I'll walk you through it, but I'm here at the lake. It's a beautiful, beautiful day. It's cloudy, a little bit of rain here and there. I just had lunch with my dad. But allow me to show you the progress on the boat. When you walk in, this is what you see at the moment. It's a bit messy. <laughs> It's fine. Here's the view from the front of the boat. So much lights coming in here. Nice little kitchen eating area. We come down here, an actual kitchen. We've got the refrigerator as well. Uh, this is going to be a bedroom one day. <laughs> one day it will be. Just maybe not anytime soon. There's a bathroom in here. Hello, how you doing? If we go back here and down this way, this is another bedroom, which I can actually sleep on now, which is exciting. TV here and another bathroom. Hello to the world. How you doing? Oh, and it also has a shower in here too. Yeah, this boat is definitely making progress. I love this boat so much. I cannot wait until it's all pretty and I'm able to take it out in the summertime. I'm going to enjoy this boat for years to come. And I don't know if you can hear that. That's the heating of the boat, I think. I don't know. I'm still learning the noises of this boat. <laughs> we can also go all the way up top. What a view. <laughs> I'm in the captain's seat. I am the captain. There's the boat. That's where we just were. I'm doing some research on some boat stuff. And other boaters letting me take a look at his boat, so I'm gonna go say hi. One of my boat neighbors let me onto the boat to see the difference between hardwood and carpet as the flooring in the boat. And I think the carpet is beautiful, but I am leaning towards hardwood. But I appreciate them showing me what finished carpet looks like on a boat. There's a lone buoy right there. What's he doing? He's floating by himself. This is also one of my favorite drives at the lake. This is the Buford Dam. It does feed the Chattahoochee River on the other side. I've been at this lake for 12, 15 years, so... I always look forward to this drive. It's very peaceful all year round, and this is what you see on the other side of a dam. There's goats on the hill, there's people in the river. It's beautiful. There's goats. Hi, goats. Just looking at me. <laughs> hey, post-production butters here. I am reading the Wikipedia page for the Buford Dam, and I have to reveal this information to you all. It's so funny. <laughs> they have a section completely dedicated to the goats. They use goats to maintain the grass and vegetation on the slope as it is more economically viable than alternatives. <laughs> goats have been used since the 1970s for this purpose, and there are 16 goats that maintain the ground, known as the Chew Crew. The Chew Crew! <laughs> There is also a donkey on site that is used to protect the goats from coyotes. <laughs> you can't make it up. Well, maybe you can. You never know with Wikipedia, but I just had to share that information. <laughs> and we're off to Joanne Fabrics. We're here to pick out a fabric for the window treatments on the boat. Even though I was looking at all the neutral fabrics, I couldn't help but point out all the sunflower patterns I was seeing. There were so many. Maybe I'll make a pillow out of one or something. Who knows? But we narrowed it down to these two and we ended up going with this one. I about fell on that thing too, Dad. <laughs> the window treatments ain't done, but this is what it's gonna look like in the boat, if that makes sense. Hi guys, I ended up taking a little cat nap, lasted about an hour or two. It is currently uh, nine o'clock and uh, I'm finally in my office. I'm getting ready to start the night of gaming. This is how the office is looking right now, by the way. I think I need to get my pet snake some water. I have to do some laundry, I have to eat dinner, then commences all the gaming. I look so rough right now, but it's okay. This is me in my home. For dinner, I'm having this chowder that I made a couple nights ago. If y'all wanna see what I cooked, I use HelloFresh. This is not sponsored, but this is what I cooked. But two days ago, I'm gonna have the leftovers. Oh my goodness, this cat wants treats so bad. Every time I'm in the kitchen, she's just at my feet meowing for treats. You want treats? You want treats? You want, oh, you want treats? <laughs> Do you want treats? Here you go. Okay. Also, a little fun fact, I don't eat at my kitchen table normally. I sit right here, not even on the couch, just in front of my TV, and I watch something while I eat. 
And also, to kick off my night of gaming, I am going to bust open a G Fuel can. Obviously, I'm going to go with the one that has my face on it, Starfruit. If you guys are not familiar, this is my G Fuel flavor, and I love it very much. Yes. Oh, it's so good. And after I eat, I am going to get the dishwasher going. I'm going to, uh, oh, I have to do laundry. I forgot about that. And then after I do all that, I'm going to be doing some severe gaming. This is my cat. She's very nice. Hi. Thank you so much. She tries to turn off the light switches. Sometimes she's successful. <laughs> okay. Poe needs water. Hey Poe, how you doing? This is my pet snake Poe. He's very good. He's out and about right now. I just got him a little bit of water. These are the pants I thrifted yesterday. I wanna try them on really quick. They're corduroy, and they're kind of a tan color, but you can't tell because I don't have the lights on in here. These are kind of fun. Hold on. I feel like I should be in karate with these on. Hello? These are kind of cool and really comfy. That was a good find. Here is the current status of my setup. Really not that bad. I'm quite proud of myself for keeping it as clean as it is. All right, I'm finally here at my setup. <laughs> Feels like it's been all day because it has. Here I am. I think the plan for tonight is to grind MW2 and level up some weapons. I don't really feel quite like recording tonight. I feel like if I did, it wouldn't be a very energetic video, so I don't want to do that. But for now, I'm gonna hop into the video game, perhaps see what's happening in the social media space, maybe catch up on some emails. You know what's something I haven't done in a while? Drink some water. Hey guys, if you're watching the video, drink some water. I was wondering why my skin was not looking very good for the past two days. Because I haven't been drinking water. <laughs> Lovely. Anyways, I'm going to hop into the video game. I will see you guys in a bit. Here is the view at my setup tonight. Call of Duty. I have Twitter on two tabs right now. I don't know what's going on, but about to play some COD. Grind some shipment. I've got some weapons to level up if you guys haven't seen. I have an entire checklist that I've been working on, if it'll focus. I'm gonna work on this tonight. It'll be fun. It's about time I finally did some gaming in this video. This is pretty much what I look like at my setup um, all the time. I'm playing Call of Duty. On the other screens, I'm watching either YouTube videos, Twitch live streams, I'm scrolling on Twitter and other social media. Tonight, I was leveling up one of these shotguns without double XP. Thank heavens for shipment though, and did I just... 180 on that guy oh my gosh hannah calm down i leveled it all the way and it is now ready to be recorded for a camo video and i got done at about four o'clock in the morning good morning i say morning time but it's currently 1 30. um i got a solid seven, six, seven, eight hours of sleep today i'm going to unload the dishwasher because i did dishes last night i'm gonna make me some breakfast make me some coffee i'm gonna get cleaned up and we're gonna jump into work. Words. And by the way, I got some really good sleep. I don't know if you could tell, but my skin, well, with the lighting, I don't know if you could tell. My skin looks so much better. I feel so much better. I don't know what happened yesterday. It was not my day. My skin was not having it. By the way, my cereal bowls are Pokemon. I got a Pikachu. I got a Bulbasaur. I got all of them. <laughs> What do I want for breakfast? I guess maybe some eggs and a waffle. Maybe some raspberries. I'll do that. Let me get this started. What, cat? What? Do you want to say hello again to the audience? <laughs> it's a little bright today, isn't it? <laughs> it actually jump scared me. Ta-da! Here's my breakfast. It's not the most aesthetically pleasing, but it's gonna be good. You're gonna hit the spot. Look how lovely the rainbows look at this time of day. Look who's having a wonderful sleep. Hi, honey. Good morning. Don't want to bother you. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Look at the rainbows. It's a good day today. And let us get started on some gaming and productivity. It's kind of a weird angle, but we'll go with it. Actually, you're a bit high. I kind of like this angle for live streams and stuff. Huh. 
I've got a couple of things I gotta get done here. I have to sign something. I have to. Oh! Oh, this is cool. All right, I went ahead and took care of all my emails. I am finally ready to record. I'm gonna go ahead and walk you guys through how I record videos with a dual PC setup. Here we are at my setup. So I record my face cam with OBS. Hello. I went ahead and adjusted the lights in the room. I wanted them to match me well today. I have the Doom shirt on, so I thought blue would be nice. I use this to record my face cam, and for the gameplay, I use the uh, GeForce whatever this thing I don't whatever it is I don't know it works and when all is said and done I sync it up in the editing software that I use I'll show you that later we're gonna go ahead and jump into recording long shots awesome platinum snipers yay I'll set you guys over here while I record my video how about that oh yeah I also get a thumbnail first so I have to do that this is embarrassing but I'll show you so to get a thumbnail I record my face cam and then I do certain facial expressions like I'm back in cheerleading with a Wow! Hey! YouTube! Video! Thumbnail! You know, to get the right emotion for whatever I want my thumbnail to be. I'm gonna get the thumbnail really quick. Here I go. Watching this in post-production is very cringy. <laughs> but I have to get my thumbnail somehow. Um, I'm making all kinds of facial expressions and uh, changing the angle that certain facial expressions are to make sure I get the exact facial expression I want for my thumbnail. How many times can I say facial expression? When does this end? I'm gonna cut it right here. I got a couple potential thumbnails. That was awful. <laughs> and now I'm going to hop into the video game. And before I start, I always do a test recording just to make sure that the audio is working okay. So I'm gonna do that super quick. That's good. I'm gonna test this one as well because I didn't before. Test, test. Okay, okay, that one's good. Let me test gameplay. And we're good. On that note, I'm gonna go ahead and hop into recording. I'll leave this running for a bit, but I will see you guys after the video. Desi, one, two. I don't have to do it anymore. I don't know why I do. Sync up audio. Right, right, left, left, right, right, left, left. Should be good. Hey y'all, it's Butters. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having an absolutely fantastic day full of positivity and happiness as always. <laughs> But without further ado, shall we hop into the video game and get some long shot awesomes? Yeah. Wanna say hi? <laughs> say, guys, wave to the camera. Why aren't you waving? <laughs> Hello, it's the next day. This is my outfit. I'm back in those corduroy pants because they're so comfy. I'm in a very comfy outfit today. And we are back at the setup. I don't have my RGB lights on ready. Didn't make much of a difference. Oh well. I finished up recording yesterday and I had to charge my camera battery so I didn't vlog anymore, but I made dinner. Um, I watched 28 Days Later. Uh, I would argue that is the best zombie movie that's ever been made. At least it's my favorite. For today's task, I'm gonna continue working on that video. I am going to have a call with Scuff to discuss the launch of my Scuff controller, which I don't even think I've shown in this video, but I'm gonna go ahead and show it because I'm pretty sure this video is gonna go up after this is revealed, but there it is. I am beyond ecstatic about this design. I was so heavily involved in the design process. I love it so much. Just, it's my controller. I'm so excited about it. This will be for sale. I'll link it down below if it is available. I will assume it is. Bye, cat. But I have a call with Scuff, and then I have a call with my managers just to kind of benchmark and see what we want to do for 2023. I need to take this nail polish off of my nails. <laughs> been here for too long. I already had my coffee today. I haven't eaten though, but I'm gonna have these calls and then eat and then video. Yes. See you guys in a bit. Here we go with a call from Scuff. I'm obviously not gonna show the entire call, but I was playing around with a pen while talking to them and I dropped the cap, so I guess that's something. I just had a wonderful call with Scuff. Um, I might have to pivot my Platinum Snipers video a little bit. Um, I might do a little switcheroo because I uh, just got the green light on when my controller is officially coming out and I want to do a video on the day that the controller releases. I want to do a hand cam video. So y'all might actually get to see the setup of a video I don't normally do. So I need to call my managers. Hello, hello, how goes it? I just had an amazing call with my managers. We just kind of talked about goals for 2023 and I always feel so motivated after these calls. They are fantastic. So shout out uh, Cody and Cole Hawk at Up North Management. You guys are amazing. Uh, I tell them that all the time, but I gotta tell y'all. 
they're great. <laughs> but for now, I think I want to redirect this energy into editing my video for a bit, see how I feel, and then potentially um, recording that hand cam video. Or more of this video, I'm not sure yet. So I will see you guys in a bit. Hi. I'm editing my video right now, but my cat likes to sit on me when I edit sometimes. After editing for a bit, I do like to take a breather and play some Animal Crossing or even go outside or whatever it may be. Uh, I love playing Animal Crossing because I can just hold my arms in the air and chill out, play however I like because that's how the Switch controller works. Animal Crossing is probably the best de-stressing game that I have. I've been playing it for three years straight, still love it just as much. I also got my HelloFresh in for the week, so here are the meals that I have. I have this salmon dish, I have this uh, crispy kicking chicken dish, I have this, oh, this pasta dish is so good, and these pancakes. What is this camera angle? I'm playing some COD, I'm warming up before I record. <laughs> Why did I set up my camera like this? Hold on. Hello, I'm currently warming up on some COD. I plan on recording my Platinum Snipers video here in a bit, but Call of Duty. I died, can you tell? With my face lighting up red. <laughs> and we're recording, again. Right, left, right, left, right, left. I'm getting the last frame for my video. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, if you go to the end of any of my videos, there is a split second frame of something really random. I'm getting it right now. Okay, I got it. I finished recording. It went great. Now I'm gonna grab my SSD and I'm going to move my face cam gameplay from my streaming PC to my gaming PC, sync it up and edit. All right, so I went ahead and got everything into the video editing software. I've got about an hour and 40 minutes to edit. Won't take too long, but I am tired tonight. Since my scuff video is a high priority at the moment, I went ahead and set up my face cam with a controller cam so that I can record this tomorrow if you guys wanna see what it looks like. My pet snake Poe has his own webcam on live streams, but I borrow this when I want to use it for hand cam videos. And it attaches to my desk like this, temporarily. But looks good, pretty happy with it. Gonna make for a good video, I hope. And with that being said, it's currently almost four o'clock in the morning and I am ready to get some sleep and get rolling on this hand cam video tomorrow. So I'll see you in a bit, as per usual. <laughs> good morning, it's the next day. Uh, here is today's fit, if you all care. I am wearing my split dye denim pants because my scuff controller has the kind of split design so I thought it would be suitable for the video. And I'm really feeling like it's a flannel day, but if I'm recording and I'm holding up the controller to show it off, I feel like this might be a little loud of a pattern. That is something to keep in mind. So I might switch it out for a denim shirt here in a bit, we'll see, but I'm hungry. I need food. I made some grilled cheeses. I plan on making some salmon later tonight though. It's gonna be delicious. I'm also gonna make some G Fuel. My cat's gonna come and investigate first, okay. I have not properly had Berry Bomb since it came out. Uh, G Fuel just sent me this tub, which by the way, thank you guys so much. You all are incredible. But I usually do a scoop and a half maybe. Drinking out of the Carnage Shaker because I love Carnage Clan. That is very good. <clears throat> you guys, my manager sent me a bunch of cookies with a note that said, can't wait to have another successful year working together. That's the sweetest thing. I had a call with them yesterday. They said nothing about it. Just showed up at my door today. I'm eating one of these cookies. It's rainbow confetti. It's very good. Thank you guys. Thank you, Cody and Cole. That's so sweet. Also, I had a slight wardrobe change. I switched out the flannel shirt for this denim shirt. And the reason why is I think that the controller stands out more against the denim shirt, more so than against the flannel. I think the flannel is a little too loud. I don't want y'all focusing on the pattern of that. I want you to focus on my controller. <laughs> also, the yellow and orange just contrast really well with the blue. I think it looks nice. I'm gonna eat my cookie. I have to sign something. I have to submit some information. So I'm just gonna keep on working. Do I like the color in here? Something that I always do before I record is adjust the RGB lights in the background to match my outfit or whatever I want to show off. So today I'm matching with my scuff. Very important business. Hey y'all, it's Butters. I wanted to pop in and let you guys know that my scuff controller is officially out and available now. It just exudes positivity and happiness as always. He. <laughs> I think I got enough footage. All right, so now I gotta move that over to my gaming PC to edit it and get it ready for uploading tomorrow. I just finished making the TikTok Instagram video for my scuff controllers. Now I'm working on my uh, controller cam video. So you see, I'm looking at this. So I've got my face cam here, as you can see. I've got the controller cam here. 
as you can see. I wore the split dye pants because I thought it would be fun with the controller, but I think it kind of takes away from the controller. I think I want to put a blanket down, so I'm going to do that. I do have this purple, oh, 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 God. I do have this purple blanket, and I think if I lay it down like this, maybe the cats will lay on it during the video, so I'm going to try that. Yeah, I like the blanket way more, personally. We're going to go with that. I dropped my controller and I knocked the batteries out. Oh, no. I'm going to go ahead and record this video, and I will be right back. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, here we are. Everything's good. Let's play the video game. Here we go. Ooh, who are you? I cannot swim. I cannot swim. Help. I can't swim. I can't swim. I can't swim. Oh my gosh. All right. I recorded. I feel great. My space buns are falling out, so I'm going to go ahead and get a bit more comfortable and get on to editing this video. My cat did end up getting on the blanket, but not visible in my video. But there she is. She's so comfy. Hi. I was gonna make a more fancy dinner tonight, but I figured I'm in editing mode. I'm gonna make me some pizza rolls. So I did. Can't go wrong. But here I am editing my video and uh, watching the dead meat kill count for, I believe, the evil dead. I think it's what I was watching. It's time. My scuff is coming out right now. It is 3 p.m. Ah! Here's the caption. If you guys can see, I'm gonna post it. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Oh my gosh, it's live. I'm terrified, but I'm so excited. Ah! Here's the website with it. Oh my gosh, how exciting. Play smooth like butters. Who did that? I love that. Shout out whoever did that at Scuff. And if we scroll down, look, it's me. And I have a little bio. I have a quote down here as well. Oh, I'm so excited. This is a moment in time. Now I'm going to post the TikTok that I made. And I'm also going to post it to Instagram. Ta-da. Hi, my buddy Matt just called me. Hey! <laughs> hey! <laughs> Congratulations on getting the scuff controller. It's been a fun ride watching you grow from playing clone hero in college to now getting the scuff controller. It's really dope. Thank you. I, I appreciate you and, and our friendship. Thank you so much. You're great. Of course. Of course. All right, friends. Have a good rest of your day. Thank you. Soon. Yep, sounds good. Have a good one. See ya. Bye. Bye. He's awesome. Oh, I have really good friends. It's the next day and I bet you guys are wondering where I'm at. I'm actually in my guest room, which just so happens to have a guest gaming PC setup and streaming as well. I haven't really gone into detail about this too much on social media. I want to do a better video kind of showcasing it. Uh, but if you want some B-roll of how it looks right now at nighttime, here you go. Look at the RGB. And I do have a gaming streaming PC in here as well, which is built from mostly parts that I had lying around. It's a great PC. I'll talk about it more in another video eventually, but this is my backup PC in case any of my other PCs have a problem. But here's the PC that I'm working on today. Oh, you can see me. Hi. This was my first GPU. How cute. This is my Facebook gaming PC. I did a video where I built it. I bought it off the Facebook marketplace and I got recognized too, by the way. The plan is I'm going to be selling this PC. It's kind of collecting dust here. I don't like when technology does that. It's a wonderful PC, but the person I'm selling it to is going to get a lot more use out of it than me. So I'm going to go ahead and put the GPU in there, clean it up a bit, factory reset it, and I'm going to be getting that to him today. Can I help you? <laughs> what are you doing? Are you a PC builder? Y'all might be wondering, Hannah, why are you on the floor right now when there's a perfectly good desk? Well, I don't know. <laughs> I didn't want to unplug that PC, but let's give this a good old power on test. Hi, cats. Hello, you gonna help? Thank you. All right. Look at all the RGB. And we got a post, beautiful, love that. Thank you, cat. Very helpful. <laughs> if y'all ain't seen the inside of this PC, here's what it looks like. I still gotta wipe it down a bit more, but it's a nice looking PC, honestly. Yes! Love that. Oh, we do not need to update nothing. We are giving this a good old factory reset. So fun fact, to do that, nice little shortcut here, hold shift and press restart. There you go. And we're gonna trailable shoot. We're gonna reset this PC. We're gonna remove everything. Local reinstall. Yep, 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 yep. All right, and we're off. It has been done, fully reset. I'm a little sad selling this PC, but I am really happy that it's going to a home where it's gonna get daily use. Hi, I'm going out to Korean barbecue with my best friend who I haven't seen since last year. I'm so excited. Here's my outfit, if you guys care. I'm wearing like these flare jeans that I thrifted a long time ago, but yeah. 
I'm excited to have some Korean barbecue. Upon further research, it is cold outside, so I put on my favorite jacket at the moment. I shouted it out in one of my videos not too long ago, but I like it, and I have my bag. Time to go, and I'm bringing the PC with me as well. I'm gonna be dropping it off at the friend's house. I will see y'all in a bit. And here is the whole fit. Did I just rhyme? I didn't get any footage of actually eating the Korean barbecue because I didn't want to be that content creator at dinner, but here I am in the bathroom jamming out to K-pop. <laughs> I woke up and I saw the rainbows in my bedroom and said, uh-oh, because you know what that means? Currently 4.30. These rainbows only hit my room for like an hour or two late. With that being said, I have to go get groceries. I have to stop by the post office. Maybe I'll make a quick Goodwill trip to see if I can find a frame for my YouTube letter. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Actually, wait, before we go. There's no light on, but this is how I look today. Yeah. I ain't got nobody to impress, that's for damn sure. <laughs> I'm on a mission. I got some stuff to accomplish. Here we go. Oh my gosh, I stopped by the post office and I was gonna say something, but then I saw the camera angle. We're not doing that angle. Next up, I decided to stop by Goodwill to see if I could find some more picture frames. Uh, somebody left the card out in the parking lot and I made me mad apparently, but I put it back. Saw this card again, liked it, had a hole. Here is a mirror. Um, here is a pink shirt that I thought was kind of cute, but the neon green sleeves, absolutely not. I put that back. Denim shirts, love denim shirts. You can always find them at the thrift, which is great. Um, these camo pants, they were in the wrong section, but I was fascinated. So I took them out, I measured them. They are my size. I may or may not have bought them. And these ones too. Oh my God, I definitely bought those, but I didn't buy these ones, to be honest. They were too small. More camo, more camo. I love camo. Camo's great. I saw these picture frames and I immediately thought my sister would love them. So I picked them up for her. I saw this little butterfly, butterfly frame, butterfly frame, more frames, silver frame. I like this frame. Look, it's me in the reflection. Hello. I picked up the silver frame. I like it a lot. And look at these jutes, these jean boots. Are you kidding me? Why did I not pick these up? I just got back from running errands. I was only out for two hours, but I am exhausted. It's probably because I didn't eat before I went out. I'm going to cook dinner here in a bit. <laughs> You're so cute. I made this mix of G Fuel today, which I had way back in college. It used to be lemonade and phaseberry. It's now a different name, but oh my gosh, it's so good. I haven't had that mix since college. It's as good as I remember, too. I did a load of laundry. I uh, cleaned up the kitchen a bit. I have some things on my to-do list I gotta do. I gotta sign some stuff. And I'm probably gonna play a little bit of COD until I'm ready to cook dinner. Did I mention I took a cat nap? Yeah, I did that. I look like an egg on camera right now. <laughs> Now it's time to get back to work on the top monitor there. I am watching my buddy Amanda the Jedi. She had released her uh, Megan review, so I definitely had to watch that. Got back into grinding some Call of Duty for the night. As you can see, I am still an objective player all the time. Look at me go. I even point at my controller. Look. Objective player. Well, yeah, this is pretty much how I look whenever I'm playing video games at my setup. I usually have something playing on the monitor and then I am grinding the video game. And after I was done playing Call of Duty for a bit, I decided to edit my video as well. A very productive night. Good morning. I already made myself a cup of coffee. I painted my nails last night. They're like a dark green color. I like them. But today I'm going to the boat show in Atlanta. I'm going with my best friend and my dad. I want to do some research on boats. I want to see what's going on in the boating industry. I just want to see some damn boats. But before I venture out into the world, I am cooking my favorite breakfast bowl. It's not anything super fancy. You fry some potatoes on a sheet with some spices that you like. You throw some spinach into a pan and you salt it. Put some cheese in the bowl if you want to. And then top it off with two eggs, however you like them cooked. I prefer them over easy. I like them running. It's my favorite breakfast meal before a convention. I don't know why, just tradition. But I will see you guys at the boat show. Here's today's outfit. Margaritaville shirt. And ready, ready? Flame boots. Because that's how you show up at a boat show. <laughs> All right, I'm off. Boat show, boat show, boat show. Can we go down that way or just do a circle? I like to zigzag. Okay, all right, let's do it. We're at the boat yeah, show. Right. It's my first time here. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't think so, but my best friend Hi. is. This is Lacey, she's great. Tiny speedboat, tiny speedboat, but most importantly, tiny pontoon. Oh my goodness. I didn't know what to expect at a boat show, but there were so many vendors and so many cool products. And of course, Margaritaville. I was wearing a Margaritaville shirt. And look at these propellers, they're so shiny. Am I tall enough to be in the mirror? No. <laughs> are you tall enough to be in the mirror? Yeah, you are. I can't. <laughs> and off we go looking at some fun and different boats. I had such a good time with this. My best friend said, don't let me buy a wakeboard. She said, I like this one. I said, you don't need it. She said, you're right and put it back. 
There were sparkly boats everywhere, which I loved. I definitely was looking at the combination of this dark gray and brown fabric together because I think I'd like to do something like that on my boat. There were cowboy boots everywhere. To go on a boat, you had to take off your shoes. There was just cowboy boots everywhere. It was so funny. Uh, lots of boats, a 100% electric boat. I was fascinated. I don't know how that would work. I mean, I guess electricity. Anyways, jet skis, love jet skis. I own one. These things were so tall. Look at them go and look at this sparkly boat matching with the trailer. Excuse me, you, you can't park there, sir. Boats. Many a boat. I kept coming back to this boat, but whoever was on it honked the horn when I got too close. <laughs> oh, okay. Like, Joystick controls? I can probably do that. But overall, absolutely fantastic time at the boat show. I had a great time. Lots of pontoons, not as many big boats as I was expecting, um, but had a great time walking through Atlanta. I always love visiting Atlanta. Atlanta is my happy place. Every time I travel, I'm like, this place is cool, but man, I can't wait to be back in Atlanta. Hi, I'm back home from the boat show. It was a phenomenal time. I'm so glad I got to spend time with my dad and my best friend. Uh, now I'm gonna chill out, play some Animal Crossing. And I don't know, maybe take a nap. I only got two hours of sleep last night and I am feeling very tired. You okay? Good old Animal Crossing. What a great way to wind down the day. Look at my star hat. Good morning. It's the next day. More productivity. I want my RGB lights. RGB? Feeling purple today. I made some breakfast, scrambled eggs with cheese and ham, and then the potatoes that I had yesterday. Time to get to work. I have a couple of business things to catch up on and then edit video and either upload or stream. Haven't decided yet. And we're back to work again. Shocking, I know. I'm just checking some business emails here, eat my breakfast. The breakfast was delicious, by the way. And I edited most of my video, if I remember correctly. It has been a couple of hours and now I'm about to stream. I have my just starting screen up on my stream. I'm about to press go live and then I'm gonna post to Twitter that I'm live and post to my Instagram story that I'm live and then actually talk to the chat. This is my first stream of 2023, surprisingly. I'm really excited about it. I'm in a good mood today. I feel good. When I feel good, I want to stream. All right, Fast and Furious, what, two minutes? So you ready? I'm starting the stream. Whenever you see my stream is starting screen up on my live stream, this is exactly what I'm doing behind the scenes. I am posting to my Instagram story to let people know that I am currently live. I got jump scared by my own sub alert. <laughs> Here, I'm posting to my Twitter that I'm live, and now the stream begins. There's so much going on. I was doing all my stuff, and I got jump scared by Through the Fire and Flames. We carry on. <laughs> Hi, how are you all doing? Happy 2023. Oh my goodness, this is so exciting. Good to see you all. Oh, I'm also vlogging. I, I forgot to mention you guys, I'm vlogging. Would you guys like to be in my vlog? I'm doing a, a week in the life vlog to show my, the view that I have right now. That's you guys right there, on this monitor right here. Uh, you're also up there, that camera right there. Would you guys like to say hi? I'm going to put the camera onto the chat and you all can say hi if you'd like to. Hello, hello to the wonderful world of YouTube. Hi guys, thank you, this is so sweet. Oh, this is adorable. I'll be on YouTube one day, well that day is today, or I guess whenever I upload this video. <laughs> hello, stream went great, my hair is up in a claw clip because I could not be bothered, but I am cooking dinner. I forgot to film the uh, beginning process of that, but this is what I'm cooking tonight. Yeah, but instead of mashed potatoes, I am frying them because I don't have the energy to mash potatoes right now. Now we wait. This dinner hit the spot. Look at these potatoes. Look at this chicken and the green beans. Look at it all together. Oh my goodness, it was so good. Can you tell? I took a bite and I did a little happy dance. This dinner is delicious. I also haven't mentioned what time it is. It's two o'clock in the morning. Sometimes you gotta have your own candle at dinner at two o'clock in the morning. <laughs> but this is divine right now. I'm gonna eat this, clean up, get the dishwasher going, and then I'm gonna sleep and see y'all tomorrow. Hello, it's the next day. I'm gonna be uploading my Platinum Snipers video today. I went ahead and edited, edited, edited it all. Woo. And I'm going to render it and make a thumbnail and upload and yada, yada, yada. So long story short, when you edit a YouTube video, as you can see, this is fully edited. Here's all the clips and all the cuts that I made. But after you make those cuts, you have to actually render out the video. I'm saving this in Platinum Snipers. I'm going to save it as final one because I did IT and that's just what I do. And we press render. And while this is happening, I always post to my Instagram story that I'm rendering a video so people can get excited for when the video comes out. Oh God. <laughs> 
Why does it always do the front camera? Let's switch that around. And then I always say render, render, render. It just lets people know that I am currently rendering a video and plan on uploading here pretty soon. And we post. I'm gonna let this render and then after it's done, I'm going to make my thumbnail. Render is done. Now we're uploading. Uh, I don't know what to title this yet. Platinum snipers, I guess? I don't know. Um, we'll come back to it. I'll add tags in a bit. Uh, I am playing Modern Warfare 2. I save it as unlisted, save, and it should be uploading. Now begins the thumbnail process, which usually takes a pretty good amount of time. Uh, this thumbnail is from my LAB camel grind video, but while I'm editing my video, I'll usually go through and I'll save screen grabs of stuff that I think could be nice for the thumbnail. Like for example, I have a whole bunch of face cam ones. I've got different expressions, cause you never know. I made this face cause I didn't know if the long shot grind was gonna be good or not, but I don't think I'm gonna use that one. Let me get a backdrop here. Can I just get something? We'll start with that as a backdrop. I'm going to drop in a facial expression. I kind of like this one, but it's really similar to my lab one, so I might not use it. I kind of like this one. Oh, I like my hair in this one. My hair looks so good that day. Oh, my hair look even better in this one. Well, oh, this might be the winner. I like this one a lot. Oh, this one's good too. I had a really good day that day. <laughs> I think I want to go with this one. So we'll drop in that facial expression. And I'm going to start photoshopping myself out of the background like so. I don't do a perfect job when it comes to this because I don't want to spend too much time on it. Okay, gonna do that. Make a selection, uh, create a layer mask, and there you go. I'm gonna take her and move her over here. Probably do this a bit. Yeah, they're similar in size. This works. I look so tan here, and then I look so pale. What the heck? I'm gonna paste this layer style on here. It kind of adds that white outline on the outside of me and whatever else I put it on. And basically I'm gonna do the same thing with the gun that I'm gonna put on the right side and then I'll take this into Lightroom and I'll show you how that works. So here's the thumbnail that I have so far. I like it. Uh, let's go ahead and take it into Lightroom. I used to not use Lightroom very much, but I've really gotten into it. I think it just takes your thumbnails to the next level. So let's bring this thumbnail in and let's get to work. Here we go, making some Lightroom edits. It's very minuscule edits, but it adds up in the end and looks so good. Definitely worth it. This is the before. And this is the after. Before, after. I'm going to export this into my thumbnails folder. My video has finally uploaded. Checks are complete, which basically means that um, monetization wise, there were no issues. And now I'm gonna go through, change the thumbnail. I love this thumbnail, look at it. You can see the little crosshairs and everything. I like this one a lot. Why did I decide to vlog myself replacing the light bulbs in my bathroom? <laughs> my video was uploading, I had to do something. Look at those light bulbs go. Holy cow, it's so bright in my bathroom now. I have added all the tags, I edited the title, everything seems good to go, so now I'm gonna go ahead and make this public. So public, done, save. And now we're live! The next thing I do after I make a video public is I go and change it to my channel trailer. So when people first stop by my um, YouTube channel, this will be the most recent video that they see. Next I go to good old twitter.com and we're gonna post about it. And I always include the thumbnail as well. Social media definitely loves visuals. As the tweet, I'm gonna tweet it. And then I go and I pin it to my profile. Then the next thing I do is I post to my Instagram story, so I'm gonna do that really quick. Here I go. Oh, would you look at that? I get new video on my channel, Platinum Snipers, so many long shots, and guess what? They're awesome. So feel free to watch the video if you want to, you don't have to. My hair looks so flat right now. Click the thing. <laughs> I should re-record that, but I'm not going to. It's fine. It'll it'll work. And I'll show y'all how I do this. I do a link. I do youtube.com slash noisy butters. And this is my Instagram story. Uh, it has audio too. So feel free to watch the video if you want to. You don't have to. My hair looks so flat right now. It does. Click the thing. <laughs> and then the last thing I post to is my Facebook page. So I just take this, I copy and paste my tweet. Exactly. I just put it on my Facebook page. I do have a noisy butters Facebook page, by the way. You're more than welcome to like it if you want to. I don't post there as much as I would like to, but maybe I should increase the frequency. And that's pretty much all I do for new YouTube videos. So now I'm gonna go ahead and probably play some Call of Duty for the night and uh, level some guns. And I will see you guys with uh, whatever I see you next in. Cool. Hello, it's two months later. <laughs> I just finished editing this week in the life vlog. So what did you guys think? Comment down below and let me know. If you enjoyed this, please feel free to leave a like to let me know that you did. It was a lot of work. Definitely worth it though. But this vlog consisted of me recording, streaming, editing, uploading, making thumbnails, a little bit of a house update, boat update, 
going to a boat show. This is my life in a week. Yes, that would be what the title says. <laughs> I'm gonna drink my coffee and upload this video. Like, comment, please subscribe if you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. Whatever I make, bye 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 this cup is very hot. I was holding it like this, and so I did the bye-bye with the other hand, and I feel kind of weird now. But it's okay. I did it nonetheless. Okay. Goodbye. Have a great day.